my main experience in my life that uh, I was always able to adjust myself to certain situations. Whatever, whatever was available, I did. When you, you ask me in the army, did you have trouble? No, I was adapting myself to the situation. When, as a matter of fact, uh, when I was in the, in the camp, you know, that was, it was in the camp. I want to treat the officers and super supervisors in the camp, they start liking me. One guy said to me, it's a shame that you be here. I said, I said to myself, don't worry about it, I'm not going to be there too long. In view of the fact of what happened over there, never anymore. And uh, so that, that's, that's that. I started to, to teach uh, bar mitzvahs and bat mitzvahs. And, uh, I did this for quite a few years for nothing. As a matter of fact, I was a rabbi who they said to me, how come you teach all these kids and you're never invited to, 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 the, to the party or sell them? I don't understand that. I said, I don't understand either, but I don't care. One thing is I never hid my religion. I never told anybody anything that I am not. Even when I was in the French Foreign Legion, which is not extremely Jews friendly. I never denied to be a Jew. I happened to be in a position where I could myself be very defensive about the, if I needed to be. But I was not. Because I was the head of the barbershop wherever I went. Where the, where there were only two of us in a regiment of about twelve or fourteen hundred. Even there I was in the position of controlling my, 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 myself, uh, being in control of myself, not of anybody else. If I wanted to go out and uh, get a, a leave of 24 hours, I went to a, a lieutenant of mine and say, I would like to. He gave me a piece of paper, so I did it out of one. Why do people need to learn about uh, the Roman Empire? Why do people learn to know about the, the Greek uh, Empire, why do people know to learn our own history, which is 3,000 and some years? Why do people to learn anything? The uh, Holocaust is something which is an event. There have been events like this before. Maybe not purely Jewish, but uh, there have been Holocausts. How can you exist, in, especially in this world, without having knowledge of whatever? I didn't go to college, but I have been learning all my life. It is very hard to be judgmental. I mean, to judge people. Uh, everybody should be able to believe in whatever he wants to believe, as long as he, I'm not going to my next door neighbor who is Italian and say, hey, I don't want your Christmas lights shining in my bedroom. Or it annoys me, this annoys me. And he doesn't come to me and say, uh, uh, I want you to eat on your kippur. If I want to eat or not, it's none of your business. So that, that's the way I was living all my life. I, I, I really, really haven't tried to influence people. I tell people when they want to hear my story, but I didn't come to you and say, well, they want to hear something? People come to me. Want to hear something? I tell them what I know. My father valued education. Because if you live long enough and learn long enough and, and, and have enough to eat, and if you have brains, you can, you can, you can be. You don't have to have money. If you have brains, you can make it. You can make it. I talk to children. I tell them my story. If it makes any kind of impression on them, if one out of a hundred does it, then I have accomplished something. I'm not doing this because I want to be known and so you know. I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to moralize. Mm -hmm. Because nobody really actually is perfect. I'm not perfect. The way it sounds, that uh, I had a perfect life. I didn't have a perfect life. If, if one doesn't have a moral background or a moral, a sense of moral, morality, then forget about it. You can, can, can teach him. But if you, if you can be on a certain way, you work your life straight without having end, ended up in personal difficulties, moral. No, nobody is perfect morally, but morally, uh, 
if you try to be to be forward and, and, and just live, and, and you have a piece of bread and somebody comes and wants to share, you give them a little share of it. If uh, you have a piece of bread and see somebody hungry and don't give it to him, it is your own way of living. For me, uh, life wasn't that, in spite of being complicated, it was very complicated. I have learned that uh, as long as you go straight, you can make it. So where do you want to go from here?